Hey guys, Jack Scalfani here. Okay, listen up, because there's a lot going on. It's the official Thanksgiving episode. Even though I have more Thanksgiving type episodes, I'm gonna do some side dishes and desserts and stuff. Uh, I get really geeked this time of year because, because this is the most important time of year for cooking. And people love to cook for Thanksgiving. So uh, those of you in Canada, I hope you had a great Thanksgiving last month. Uh, now it's time for us to do the American Thanksgiving prep. I have two birds, and I'm gonna tell you all about that in a moment. But since it's a big episode, I got a call. I wasn't expecting any more sponsorship from Harry's Razors, but Harry's Razors called and wanted to sponsor the big Thanksgiving episode. So I wanna thank them for being a sponsor, but I wanna thank you guys. You have no idea what a great success Harry's Razors has been on the show that uh, from what I've heard, all the feedback from you guys, everybody who's tried it and took advantage of my discount has loved it. Uh, so take care, take my discount, use it if you haven't done it yet. Get a little gift box, and they even have this new thing now. Look, you got the, this box here. You get the foam and the razor, or the razor blades and the razor, and this is cool. This is for traveling. This little cap goes right on top of your razor. I've always wanted one of these. I didn't know, I don't think anybody makes a cap for your razor. They do for your toothbrushes. So Harry's Razors, check it out. Uh, great gift for the holidays. If you're doing your shopping early, or on Black Friday or whatever, hit the internet, go to harrys.com, use my discount, and get yourself a razor. The razor refills are like a, like under $2 each. Blows away anything in the stores. So Harry's, thanks for being a part of the show. And you guys ready for this? Are you ready for this? Because you have been so good in this sponsorship. I'm going to do something special today. I know it's Movember and people aren't shaving, but in celebration of you guys trying out Harry's razors, I'm going to shave this off at the end of the show. One time and one time only. Let's take these turkeys and start talking about them. We're gonna smoke one and we're going to bake one and we're gonna put them side by side and see which one is better. Which one is more moist, which one's more flavorful. So here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna bring you in close and we're gonna season the one bird. We're gonna do the same thing the other bird, but I'm not gonna show it to you twice. Okay, we're gonna start off, each bowl is for each bird. We're gonna start off with two sticks of butter, one in each bowl. I'm gonna soften them just a little bit in the microwave because they're not room temperature yet. Put some brown sugar in there. Some poultry seasoning. If you know what poultry seasoning is, here's a pic of what goes into poultry seasoning. Uh, it's thyme and sage and rose. It's a bunch of basic ingredients. You can make it yourself if you want. Do salt in each. Some gar granulated garlic. Granulated onion. You wanna put heat in it, I recommend chili powder. Uh, crushed red peppers aren't really gonna penetrate well. We're gonna turn this into kind of a paste and we're going to rub it into the turkey. So let's do that right now. Okay, now, one of the things you're gonna to wanna to do is get under the skin here. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna get under the breast skin like this. There's two parts, it's connected here. You can just work your fingers under here. See? Don't puncture it, just gently. Work your way in there. However many fingers you can fit down there. Should be able to go all the way back here. So, let's see if we can do that. And you wanna disc, there's a little membrane in there. You're disconnecting it from the, from the skin. Got a little bit of rub. Gonna get it in there. Get it in there nice and good. And then you do the other side the same way. Work your finger into there to get some rub in there. Get your rub in there. If you don't wanna get your hands dirty, well, then ask one of the kids to help you. So then you're gonna turn around, you're gonna go on the back end and you're gonna get your seasoning up in there. Then you're gonna hit the outside of the bird and in the cavity. So basically you're just gonna coat the whole thing. Under the skin's more important, obviously. And then we're gonna see if we can, probably this way, we'll do it this way. Get it in the oven bag. There we go. Okay, it's all tied up. Just gonna leave it like this in the fridge overnight. 
I'm doing the other bird like this. And then meet me in the morning right here. And we're gonna prep them all right here and get them out. That's gonna be exciting. I can't wait till tomorrow. Good morning, everyone. Okay, so the birds have been seasoned all night and a little touch up seasoning on the outside, but it's the same stuff. Both birds, identical weight, bought from the same place. We're going to, uh, this one's going on the smoker. This one is going in the oven and we're going at 325. Should be anywhere between three and four hours. I'm gonna put therm thermometers in each one. So let's get this bird in first. There we go. Yep, yeah, that's gonna, that's just barely gonna make it. So there you go, it's in the oven. Wow, that is not a long cord at all. All right, so I'm just gonna put it right here. Okay, so it's really cold outside. So you're gonna hear some wind in the background. It's like in the 40s, no lie. Fall is like full on. Okay, so let me get my thermometer into the meat. This iKitchen device has a long enough cord, I love it. I like this one better than the other one I was using earlier. All right, so let's close this up. And I will see you guys in a few hours to take a look and see how the birds look. Okay, you guys ready? This is supposedly done, it's at temperature. Uh, the breast is 165, so let's take a look. Barely any, there's barely any juice even in here, it's crazy. Skin's beautiful, smells sweet. All right, so let's take this inside. We're gonna let this set for about 30 minutes, then we're gonna carve it. Let's go check on the one in the oven. Okay, so I'm gonna tell you right now, I burnt the top of this little baby because I was out tending to the other one. I had the browning wire on, I was trying to brown the outside. Okay, here's the smoked one. Here's the roasted one. We're going to cut into them in a little bit. We're gonna let them sit for about 30 minutes while I prepare some of the other side dishes that I'm gonna serve with it. Oh, you guys can't see this, but a whole bunch of juice is gushing out as I'm cutting it. This is way moist. It's beautiful. All right, let's get this cut out here. Okay. There it is. Look at that. Look how moist that is. Let's set that right there. It's very interesting. So let's cut through here. I mean, look. Look how beautiful that is. Of course, you can have a little, you can have a little smoky pink in there, but that's, that's just beautiful. All right, so just to give you a better idea, I'm gonna take the skin off each one. Put that off to the side. Stick that right there. Take the skin off this. See where he seasoned and buttered it and everything. Very cool. It's kind of cool, they look almost identical. Okay, so I'm gonna take a slice. This is the roasted one, right? This is the roasted one. Just wanna give you a shot of that. That's the piece I'm gonna try right there. And then here's the smoked one. Smoked one is a little tougher to cut, but I don't believe it's gonna taste much different. Should taste just as good. And there's the smoked piece right there. Okay, so let's give those a try. All right, so here we go. All right, that is the uh, roasted one. All right, now I'm gonna try a piece of the smoked. Oh my goodness, this is really tough. I'm concentrating so hard, they're both good, but I don't know which one's better, they're like, they're different. The smoke has a heartier uh, flavor to it uh, from the pellets and the flavoring. Um, and it, it seems a little more moist than the roasted one, but the roasted one's moist and it's a little bit salty. So I may have put a little bit too much salt into my mixture when I seasoned it. It's weird because the smoke one isn't salty. 
they had this identical seasonings. So I would have to say that I, they're even. For me, they're even. But I'm, I'm, I just called my wife to come in here in a minute and try these. She doesn't know which one's which. So we're going to uh, give her a taste and see which one she likes better. And then I'll tell you which one. But for me right now, they're equally good. I could eat them either way. Literally, they're both amazing equal. Okay, I'm going to cut you your own piece, okay? Okay. So I'm going to slice that right there, a little piece right there, and I'll slice another little piece right there. Okay. Um, so try one first, and then try the other, and let me know which one you like better. And, and the reason why I'm bringing the second opinion is sometimes you guys think that I like all my stuff, and that's not always true. I try to be honest. I really want you guys to learn from these videos. Um, yes, yeah, so you tried that one? Mm-hmm. All right. Any comments on that flavor? It's just good. It like falls apart in your mouth. Okay, good. Falls apart in your mouth. Try that one now. <laughs> ah. <laughs> she literally broke off the identical same piece. The other one was bigger, so she kept tearing it off until it was identical to the first bite. I love her. All right, how's that one taste? That's good. It's moist. Okay. Not so much flavor, though. This one has more flavor. This one has more flavor. So you would say you like that one better? No, they're just different. I mean, if, you're, if I had to choose one between the other because we're going to eat both, yeah. I would probably eat that one. Okay. But they're both good. All right. So if you, I had to eat that, I would eat that. That's the roasted one. Okay. And that's the smoked one. Okay. There you go. So my wife says that the roasted one is more flavorful. They're both good. So you can't go wrong with smoked or roasted, but it seems that I thought they were equal. She liked roasted better. So we're leaning towards roasted today. Um, but whatever you do, take your time. Don't burn the top of the turkey as you're trying to brown it like I did and have a happy Thanksgiving. I have more Thanksgiving type videos coming up. This isn't the only one. You know, it's funny. I promised you guys yesterday and I totally forgot that I'm supposed to uh, do my Harry's razor complete shave. I, I promised I would shave off my goatee. My wife just thinks I'm crazy. Um, so I'm going to go shave it off, and I'll be right back, and then I'll say goodbye. So just don't go away. I'll be right back. Here it is. It's never happening again. I completely shaved it off for you guys for your entertainment only. So what do you think? Yeah, I kind of like the goatee better. It's the only time it's gonna happen, so enjoy. You guys take care. It's time for me to get into Movember and start growing it all out again. So I will see you guys in the next episode. Take care, bye-bye.